she's a student. She's a, she's studying uh, marginal productivity theory, and she has this great boyfriend, Billy. Um, and everything is going great. She's kind of trying to get her sister to come out because her sister is kind of because she's kind of become a little reclusive, kind of scared to meet people. And um, then all of a sudden, uh, this one night, she just disappears. And so throughout the whole film, Jill is just kind of on this rampage um, looking for her sister. It's pretty much, you know, the two of them against the world. They don't have their parents. So it's a super strong bond. And so when she's looking for them, it's, it's, it's this really important, you know, she needs to find her other half, basically. She worries about her, you know, and she wants her. Not only does she worry that she believes that, you know, she believes everything that Jill said, so she believes that there was an abductor, I think. Um, but I think she also, so she worries for her safety, but I think she always also worries for her, her, you know, well-being, just about her, her social well-being and her, just how she's emotionally. It's been great. Um, she's awesome. Amanda is super talented and she's funny and she's, she's really, really fun to work with. I love Haytor. Um, he, Haytor is very, uh, he's very hands off. Um, he kind of, I feel like he has just a, a beautiful vision of things. Um, and he, he's, he's great. He's very supportive and really fun to work with. I think the whole thing will be uh, really exciting. Um, I think there's a, when you're watching or when I read it, there was like, a, my adrenaline was pumping, you know, throughout the whole thing. But I think at the very end um, is kind of when, you know, as it's unfolding of, of what's happened um, and how the events have happened, I think that's when everyone would be like on the edge of their seat.